Hi everyone, Stephen Stokes with Remax Sunshine. So excited today to bring you my latest listing, 5366 Cortez Court in the Yacht Club area. This is over 4,000 square feet of living space. It is on a 0.4 acre oversized corner lot, four bedroom, five bathroom, completely custom built home, 2013. We have 263 feet of waterfront, multiple docks, boat lifts, jet ski lifts, custom pool, custom everything. Plus, we've got this four-car oversized garage on the right with this additional single-car garage here that you're seeing now on the left. Semi-circular driveway. Man, there's so many things to show. Please subscribe to the channel. Give a thumbs up. And as always, I look forward to your comments. So all the doors, by the way, in this house have this crazy thing called the Z-Wave Smart Lock. You can open the doors from anywhere with your phone. I thought that was pretty cool. Let's go together and take a look. Opens up into this Great room here, but first, what about this foyer? Absolutely beautiful. Lots to see here. I'm going to spend a little extra time to show you the furniture and the decorations as well. A lot of people ask me about that. They like to get ideas. Here's your entrance way. You can see that natural wood uh, table there. And how about this massively high entrance with the chandelier? I got to like that. You got the double fan thing happening there in the great room. And how about this central pillar with the fireplace in the middle? We'll check that out in a minute. Of course, you've got all the custom flooring in here, beautiful tray ceiling, double tray ceiling. And there's that view in the background. We'll check that out later too. This is Southern exposure, great view, massive pool area. We'll be there in a few minutes. But first, let's just swing back around here and take a look at this first room. Of course, it's a great, great room because it opens up into this massive room, but we do have that fireplace in the center, which gives us a little bit of privacy in the front. Here's our first bedroom. Again, beautiful ceiling, nice big windows, big walk-in closet. We have a wood floor in here, not a ceramic plank, but an actual wood floor. Here's your bathroom. Very nice. Again, custom 2013 home. So it's going to have a 2013 vibe to it, which a lot of people like, including me. Love that cathedral window there on the left. So back out through the double doors, let's make a right and check out some of the bedrooms. But first, a quick stop in the pool bath. Again, custom tile floor in here, some dark accents. Here is your pool shower dark tile with the light flooring and the light accent. You have a window in here, nice and big for all your guests. Plus you have a nice shelf in there that you can sit on. And again, matching cabinetry, lots of places to go here. Let's, uh, no, let's not go down the hall. Let's go to the main bedroom first. So through these double doors, all of a sudden we transfer over to plush carpet, dark carpet in here, which is a nice change up. Massive closet area here, and then through this door, we're into the main bathroom. Lots to see in here. We'll start over here on the left. There's your loo, nice window in there. We have a massive shower enclosure we're going to look at in a second. But hey, how about that circular white tub? So that tub is freestanding. It's a circle. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Beautiful white circular tub that just pops right out on the contrasting dark tile floor. So that is, that's a statement. Lots of windows, as you can see in here, I didn't open them today, but there's lots of windows to let in light. And there's your dark shower enclosure. Hey, look at that sink. It's a double sink, but it's side by side. I've never seen that before. That's interesting. And of course, you've got those uh, white cabinets that just pop with the dark flooring and the dark countertop. Here's a better look at that shower enclosure with the frameless glass. Very nice. Lots of storage in here. Oh, it's so nice to have the carpet. You know, I'm so used to tile. It just feels so nice on my feet, this thick plush carpet. It's pretty cool. Here's a closet area. And of course, over here, we have some additional storage, some nice linen closet space over here in the main bedroom. This opens up to Southern exposure. So there's going to be lots of sun in here, double tray ceiling. And how about that view from the main bedroom? 
So you can just imagine waking up every morning to this. And again, this is like five minutes to open water. This is a direct access, sailboat access, waterfront property in the Yacht Club area. Only the best, right? I like this. I like this olive paint here. Again, so used to seeing the same thing. It's nice when I when I go back and look at some of these older homes when they were more creative, you know. So this is a beautiful style. Now we've got this long hallway. And what's in here? Wow, how about this bedroom? Oh, wow, I like this. Wooden floor, not ceramic, but real wooden floor, dark wooden floor. Nice window here. How about that? That's Western exposure. You see one of the boat docks out there. Lots to show when we get outside. But I like this room. It's got a nice vibe. I like the dark floors, and I like that burgundy uh, contrast wall there. That's cool. But how about this? How about your own wet bar in your bedroom? You can't go wrong with that. What's this here? Ah, fireball. Thumbs up if you know what that is. Comments below. <laughs> so somebody likes Fireball. Got it. Here is the garage that I showed you on the outside. So this is a four-car oversized garage. Lots of space in here. And this is a tiled floor in the garage. Not an epoxy covered floor, but an actual tile floor in your garage space. You've got double doors leading to the outside there. We'll see that when we go outside. That brings you out by the uh, boat lift, one of the boat lifts. Nice elevation here. You see the steps. So that's a great space right there. Wow, this house just has so much to see. It's such a pleasure for me to show it to you guys. Look at all the light out here. And I love the, the, the style. Like I just like how they, they've decorated this. It looks spectacular. Now that's a great thing. Look at that. That is a, a fireplace that you can see through. And I made a mistake. I think I said that was electric. It's not electric. That's a real fireplace, guys. Old school, real fireplace. Throw the logs in and get a flame. Here's a dining area with, again, the tray ceiling that just bleeds right into the big kitchen. And, of course, got to have a pool table in your games room with a nice bar over there. We'll check that out in a minute. But how about this bathroom? So a few things to show here. <laughs> how about the urinal? <I've laughs> this house has a urinal. So there you go. You've got a urinal there in addition to your regular loo. That's pretty cool. And by the way, that is a Versace rug in the bathroom. An actual Versace rug in the bathroom, just in case you were wondering. I know you were. Here's your bar. I can just imagine a party, everybody having a good time here in this big space. Beautiful. Now, the kitchen. Dark cabinets, beautiful countertop, right? That beautiful granite countertop. How about this fridge? That is a big, big fridge. You need a big fridge for a big house though, right? So what do you think of this kitchen? Again, you know, I show so many of the newer constructions. When you go back into the older things like 2013, you get to see how they built back then. And I don't know, but they're better. You know, this is a really high quality job here. Look at the floor, all the custom cabinets, all the wood. Just beautiful. I really like this style. Here's the bar. You got to have a bar, right? Especially if you've got a pool table. Again, over 4,000 square feet of living area uh, here in this home. And this house is on 17,380 square feet. That's a 0.4 of an acre. So you got lots of space. Plantation shutters on the windows, of course. Hey, you've got lots of space here with this pool table. You're not going to be hitting the walls with your cue. You know what I mean? Lots of space. How about an artistic shot? Let me bring it down a little bit here. 
How about that? Isn't that beautiful? I don't even play pool, but honestly, I could learn if I had this house. I think I would learn. It's just beautiful. All right. It's a telescope over there, because why not? Through this hallway here, you go into the next bedroom. Beautiful room here. And of course, you've got these two glass doors leading out to the lanai area. Double tray ceiling, custom fans. This is all uh, carpeted in here as well, which is nice. Here's your bathroom. Again, got the granite countertops. We've got the dark cabinetry. Got the loo with the window in there. And stand up shower enclosure. Very nice. I don't think your guests will mind this one bit. Very nice to have that connected there, a little privacy for them down this hallway here. Here's your laundry room. Big room, lots of space, lots of bright light coming in from that cathedral window, lots of counter space in there. Here's that extra garage. Again, you can see the elevation of the home. We go down these steps. That is a um, AC unit up there that you see above the door, exterior door, and this is a nice little addition. Right, We've got this nice high ceiling here with this single car garage, this would be a great place to put a trailer or some more toys if you have a lot of toys, which I assume if you're looking at a home like this, you probably are a guy with a lot of toys or hey, or a girl with a lot of toys. It's not just boys with toys. <laughs> toys are for everybody. Okay, guys, now let's look at the real deal. We're going to go outside here. There's so many upgrades. Now, a lot of the stuff is still under the lanai. I just opened this house, but how about that cedar plank ceiling? Let's talk about that. That is absolutely beautiful. And there are shutters, roll down shutters here. They're all up right now that close this entire area off and protect it. So you've got roll down hurricane shutters that come down and seal this entire area here off, protecting it from any bad weather or from, uh, you know, as a security measure. Here's your outdoor kitchen right here. You got a range hood, barbecue, lots of counter space. Here's your first look at that waterfront. Remember, it's 263 feet of waterfront here. By the way, we've got an exterior uh, fireplace here, and that is a real fireplace, not a digital, not an electric, actual fireplace. Southern exposure here, so you get the sun all day. You get the benefits of the sunrise and the sunset. Here's your pool. Infinity Edge overlooking that intersecting canal. All updated landscaping. By the way, this home has just about everything has been updated. Updated outdoor speakers. It's been rescreened with a super screen. I mean, it's got a new uh, pool heater. It's got two new pumps. Everything has been taken care of. There's your spa. Beautiful. So what do you think of this? What do you think of the tile out here? Hey, isn't that beautiful? Great pool. Look at that. This would be a great home to shoot a movie in. You know what I mean? <laughs> like a real Hollywood movie, it seems like. I guess I am shooting a movie, but you know what I mean. It's just extraordinary. Now, let's go out here and go waterfront. So we've got a beautiful storage uh, facility right here on the right, and that is made of block. Notice the deck. There's a jet ski lift right there. Another look at that block storage facility. We come down here. Here's some of the pool equipment with a cover on it. Your pool heater is there. Let's talk a bit about the boating and the lifts. So we've got a 60 foot boat slip here. We've got two lifts. We've got a 28,000 pound boat lift with a new canopy on it. We're gonna look at that in a second. And we've got this 10,000 pound lift right here, plus a bunch of jet ski lifts. So there's no problem here if you've got multiple boats 
can definitely make it work, right? That's the 10,000 pound lift right there you're seeing with the cover. And then we're going to look at the 28,000 in just a minute. But first, look at this beautiful canal system. And we're only minutes away from open water here in the South Cape Coral Yacht Club area. I'm going to set my smartwatch and get in some steps here because this is, again, 263 square feet of water front footage here that I've got to scoot along to show you. Beautiful. I sold that house right there a few years ago to a wonderful client. This is a very highly seeked area in Cape Coral because it's such good access. There's a look at your pool, the infinity edge of the pool, and the best for last, right? <laughs> How about this? This is a 28,000 uh, pound boat lift we're looking at here. It's a tiki hut that's been newly thatched. And by the way, this boat is also for sale if you're interested. Another jet ski lift here, just sort of, just sort of tucked on the end here. Why not? You can't have too many jet ski lifts. It's a good look at the exterior profile there, the rear profile of the home. Here's that massive boat lift. And there's your jet ski lift. Let's walk it out and take a look. This waterway system is so beautiful, active, healthy, clean, lots of fish. Uh-oh. And even some boaters, it looks like, over there. Let's zoom in and see what those guys are doing. You can see the, ma the, the really wide canal here. And you can also see some of the neighbors. There they are just out for a mild kayak or a canoe or whatever you call that. They're hanging out. Just another beautiful day in sunny Cape Coral, Florida. So what do you think of this house, guys? This is spectacular. This is one of the, one of the most impressive homes, I think, that I've ever shown. It has really everything. If you're serious about boating, if you want to live in one of the nicest areas of Cape Coral, if you want that direct golf access with lots of waterfront, I mean, this home really has everything. I just want to show you this pool because it's kind of neat. When you come in here, look at that. So you're down here and you see the pool is high and there's a retaining wall there. Look at that. Isn't that cool? I think so. Hi, I'm Steve Stokes with Remax Sunshine. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and uh, reach out anytime, 239-645-2405. If you have any real estate questions, thanks. We'll talk again soon.